What's good, YouTube? This your boy DJ Q Waves. Back again with another new video. If you're new to the channel, be sure that red subscribe button and notification bell. If you're old school, welcome back to the channel. Now, this is my live reaction from the Gucci Man versus Young Jeezy versus Battle. Okay, I'm just gonna be straight up with y'all, okay? Like, I know y'all want to round by round, but let's be honest. Young Jeezy destroyed the Gucci Man, okay? It's probably two rounds I might give Gucci Man. And it was the first round, and it was the round that he played this song. This man, Gucci man, was ain't trying to have no hit battle. He was trying to let him, just trying to disrespect this man in his face. To the world, to the public, to over millions of viewers. This man played the diss track Truth, man. The most anticipated diss track. Of, I ain't gonna say of all time. Just to be played live to the opposition. Like, that's like Tupac playing Hit Him Up in Biggie's face. People would love to see that reaction. And just to see the reaction of Young GZ, it was just priceless. Like... Gucci man is real and real. This Bible saying he's smoking his partner, smoking on Pookie Low. I'm a dick, the old dig a partner. I'm gonna send the box your way again. I'm like, God, God, like he calling Jeezy a, a bees and this and that to his face. I'm like, whoa. I'm gonna just say this Gucci man won the street battle. Young Jeezy won the music battle. Let's say that. Young Jeezy won the verses. That is point blank, period. Young Jeezy has way more hit songs. Gucci Man has more underground hits. And Young Jeezy's songs are just gonna just to destroy Gucci Man, whatever he got, throw them. You know, it don't matter. But the diss tracks saved him. Okay? The diss tracks were like two haymakers. Cause they hurt. It's like after that that true diss, then they ended the track at the end of the verses with the so icy squashing the whole beef. When I say 2020 is the craziest multiverse year of all time, man, you just never know what's gonna happen. Next, if 50 Cent and Ja Rule do a versus and be cool, Tupac and Biggie, anybody should come back alive right now and just squash their beef. Like, cause what the f is going on? It just is crazy. What a monumental battle it was. Gucci Man, Young Jeezy, man. This one is cool, man. Crazy man, one for the books. I'm glad we didn't have a Young Jeezy Ti, cause this was one. This is way more entertaining. Young Jeezy Ti was a bit more tight battle, cause they both equal the hits and they still relevant for over 15 years plus. Maybe 20, 18 years plus, probably, but probably 20. But wow, man, wow, wow, wow. Gucci Man, Lafleur, Young Jeezy, the Snowman. What a battle. <sighs> what about right, y'all? Let me know what y'all thought about the battle because that was a that was a that was probably my second favorite versus besides the just kind of brought boot. Heck about it, but that's my reaction. My whole my whole review of the whole battle with Gucci Mane, Young Jeezy. Y'all let me know what y'all thought about it. Share comments below. But as always, make sure that like button, subscribe button, and notification bell. Peace.